All right, guys, I uh, picked up some oil. Got myself an OEM Toyota of that cheap. So it was like six bucks. And I chose this oil because I heard really good stuff about it. And yeah. here's my truck. Not everybody has the luxury of a uh, hoist to do their oil changes. And that's the that's the mileage on it right now. So uh, in the owner's manual, it says break-in period is about 1,600 kilometers. So I decided to do it early. And here it is in the owner's manual where nobody ever reads it. And uh, typically, uh, I usually do my oil changes on all my cars about 4,000 kilometers. I just drain and fill it, change the filter after the second drain and fill. I don't know, that's how I do it, but everybody does it differently. I've been doing that for basically my all my cars anyways. And if you see my Honda Fit with 172,000 kilometers and I've had that for 10 years, that's that's what I that's what I've been doing. I haven't taken the valve cover off yet, but it's I'm pretty sure it's pretty clean in there. So yeah, let's uh, let's do this oil change. There's a lot of oil change videos out there, so I don't want to make this too long. You know, just top up the washer fluid, check the coolant level. It looks good. Oh, don't really need to test the battery because it's practically brand new. Uh, oil drain. People always say to break open the cap so you can drain easily but you know you do this so much you don't really need to open the cap to let it drain out <laughs> I don't know this, this is just my opinion so I put it on the hoist this is where I put it right on the frame right over there same thing on both sides And uh, this is where I typically check my tire pressures. All right, let's have a look underneath. Uh, everything looks pretty clean. I don't see any rust yet. See how it goes. Everything looks pretty nice and clean. And uh, people who are saying that the uh, you know rear axles are starting to rust, uh, maybe a little bit there, but I don't know. It's it's pretty nicely sprayed and it's nice and black. I don't see any rust. Maybe people people elsewhere would have that, but no. yeah. yeah. The back.
your oil filter. Mac Tools, not a sponsor. I think right below there is the uh, part number. This, this filter has the uh, little notches in there for the, uh, the oil filter to grab onto. Right there. Here it goes for the uh, you know the pull out. Oh, I didn't do it. Ooh, hot. That's pretty clean. You drain plug washer.
This most likely will take the whole bottle. So, pour it in there. filled up. Uh, let's start it and check the oil level. Just on the low mark. Put some more oil in it. Well, that's my oil change video for you. I don't know how you YouTubers do it, but that's how I did it. 